When will real estate quadruple in price? It's very simple. Real estate will quadruple in price the second half of next decade, 2015 through 2020. Here we have uh, another wave added to the California real estate cycle. Here in California, from 82 through 90, real estate went up for eight years. It was depressed for eight years to 98. Then it went up for eight years through 2006. And then, it, and then if you just simply add 8 to 2006, you get 2014 as a time cycle low. If you buy a property in 2014, it'll be an excellent time to buy a property. And then if you wait till 2020 through 2022, that property should quadruple in price. People that uh, bought, saw people buy homes in 98 and then they went up and they tripled in price in this second wave here, they say, oh, real estate will never do that again. I really missed out. But that is not really true. The big wave is, is yet to come, and we will see that here. Because what happened was, in, in 82, um, from 82 through 2002, we had a disinflationary wave where oil fell from $40 a barrel to $12 a barrel, and gold fell from $8.50 an ounce to $250 an ounce. Um, and so this was a disinflationary wave here. And what happens is we, have, we had inflation in the 60s and 70s, and then in these 80s and 90s, we had disinflation. Well, now in 2002, January 2002, we started an inflationary wave where gold and oil are rising in price. And so what happens is inflation favors real estate because it is priced in dollars. So if you buy, a, let's say, a $300,000 home with a um, $270,000 loan, and that property, because of inflation, goes to $600,000 in price, then you will have essentially um, used $30,000 down, down payment to make $300,000. Um, $300, so what happens is here from 82 through 90, we were in a disinflationary wave, and real estate only doubled from 82 through 90. But then from 90 through 98, we were depressed, and from 98 through 2000, and six, right there in the middle, in 2002, we hit the inflationary wave. So from 2002 to 2006, the last four years were very strong for real estate, and real estate during this wave tripled. During this wave, it, it doubled. During this wave, it tripled because we had, had four years of inflation, strong inflation. Now from 2014 to 2022, if, if this wave lasts um, 20 years, when real estate dries up, or, um, the foreclosures start to dry up the second half of next decade, 2015, 16, 17, real estate, when it snaps back, it should quadruple in price. You say, that sounds pretty far-fetched. But in 1976, a friend of mine bought a home for $60,000. And just to let you know, that was a very outrageous price. People chided him and said, you should have bought a home in Palos Verdes for 55000 You were really a fool to buy, to pay $60,000 for a home in Lomita. But seven years later, in uh, 1983, he sold that home for 450000 And so what happens is the inflation that is being caused to prop up the real estate and prop up the, um, to reinflate the economy once real estate foreclosures do dry up the middle of next decade, when they snap back, real estate should quadruple in price. You can see this at uh, alankendallportal.myindex.com and other graphs. Um, notice that index does not have an E. That's akp.myindex.com. Um, this is your host, Alan Kendall, and have a nice day. Bye-bye.